What's going on YouTube? Antoine here, Antoine Stark's channel. So today I have a tutorial for you in Photoshop CS6. I'm going to show you how to convert a logo into a fave icon or an ICO, I believe that's what the, uh, the uh, file is called. So here I have a logo. This is a logo that I'm going to be using and I have it this way for certain reasons so you can actually see what you have to do if it's like this, okay? So basically, if your logo is like this with a white background, but it's two separate layers, as you can see over here, you're going to need to click this eye, all right, on the background. So it goes to transparent background, so it'll be a PNG file, okay? Now, what we're going to do here, this is the logo, and that's how I want it. I don't want any strokes on it. I don't want any shadows or anything like that. I'm just going to upload it simply like that, okay, to the website. So what we're going to do is go up to image. I mean, is it image? Yes, it's image. Okay, then go to image size. And up here at the top where it says width, go ahead and put 16 pixels. All right, it should change the bottom height as well, as long as you have all three of these boxes checked at the bottom, all right? And we're gonna click OK, and it scales it down. So now I'm gonna go over here and make my um, viewing size to 1000, and this is what it looks like, okay? So this is what I have right now is a fave icon, all right? Now let's go ahead and save this fave icon. Go down to File and Save for Web, we're going to make sure this says PNG 24, all right? PNG 24, and let your logo uh, load up if it's not loaded. Sometimes it takes a little time depending on your computer speed and all that, and depending on the file size. But it shouldn't be much because it's only 16 by 16 pixels. Let's go ahead and click Save. Make sure the background is transparent if you just want the logo and not the background, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and name this. Um, Fave icon, go ahead and click save. All right, and let's go ahead and go over to the website. All right, um, where are we? Okay, now let's go ahead and try to add this in. Use custom icon. This is Shopify, by the way. I'm not really making the logo on how to upload it, I'm just going to upload it so it can be seen. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and click save changes. This is a video on how to convert. All right, now let's go ahead and open a new tab and open the website. All right, and there you have it. I have my fave icon on my website up here at the top, and it's over here in my favorites or my bookmarks tab. So that is how you convert a logo in Photoshop to a fave icon. Very simple, very easy to do. I hope everyone can do this and follow the instructions correctly. I'm not a professional, but you should be able to do what I did. Just copy, duplicate what I did. Thanks for watching the video. My name is Antoine. This is Antoine Stark. Thanks for watching the video. Like and subscribe. Comment if you have any questions. Thanks for watching the video.